Welcome to live2clays.com, best e-learning portal for IIT JE, NEET and Foundation. Hello students, in this video I will discuss how to calculate the value of a pre-exponential factor by using Arrhenius equation. The problem says that the rate constant, here we have k, rate constant k for the decomposition of hydrocarbon is 2.418 multiplied by 10 to power minus 5 per second. This is the rate constant value is given for the decomposition reaction of hydrocarbons. At the temperature of 546K, the, the temperature value is given. Now the question says that if, means condition is there, if the energy of activation, here we have Ea value, that is the symbol of energy of activation, is 179.9 kJ per mole, calculate the value of pre-exponential factor, means we have to calculate A value. Here you can see that rate constant K value is given temperature is given and Ea value is given that is energy of activation. We can apply the formula for the uh, Arrhenius equation. Here we have Arrhenius equation k is equal to a and e to powers Ea upon Rt. This is the Arrhenius equation. We can write it in simplified form. We can take natural log on both sides. Here we have ln k is equal to ln a and plus ln e to power minus Ea upon Rt. Ea upon rt ln and e will cancel out then set up we get ln k is equal to ln a minus ea upon rt minus ea upon rt we can convert ln into a log we know that ln is equal to 2.303 and it is log we can plug in this value here we have 2.303 and it is log k on right side we have log sorry it is 2.303 2.303 and it is uh, log a minus ea upon rt ea upon rt we can divide this expression by uh, 1 upon 2.303 and so or we can multiply we can multiply this setup by 1 upon 2.303 so that we can cancel these values here we get the set of log k is equal to here we have log a and so minus ea and see so here at the top we don't have 2.303 that's why we get here 2.303 and it is rt this is the setup we get now we can apply this formula to calculate a value that is pre exponential factor if you look at here r is a gas constant and its value is used as a joules per mole k and see in the problem ea value is given in kilojoules per mole that's why we convert kilojoules per mole into joules per mole so that same unit will cancel out. Here we can do the conversion. We have 179.9 and say it is kJ per mole uh, multiplied by here we have 1000 joules upon 1 kJ. kJ kJ will cancel out and we can multiply these values. Here we have 179, 179.9 and it is multiplied by 1000. The value which we get that is 179 uh, 900 179 and 900 and it is in joules per mole now we can plug in the values here log k k value is uh, that is let me put up here log k value is 2.418 multiplied by 10 to power minus 5 and it is in per second it is in per second then a value we are going to get in per second then we have log a on right side minus ea value we have calculated in joules per mole that is 179 and 900 it is in joules per mole upon here we have 2.303 2.303 and r value is 8.314 it is in joules per mole and k and multiplied by temperature we need temperature is given 546k that is kelvin 546k we can cancel the same unit joules per mole joules per mole will cancel out and kelvin kelvin will cancel out we are left with only one unit that is the unit of uh, rate constant per second then and a value is going to be uh, in per second now we can do the calculation here we have we can transfer this value on left side then the setup we get log a log a is equal to log bracket 2.4 here we have 418 multiplied by 10 to power minus 5 
and so it goes on left side it is negative then it becomes positive here we have positive one seven nine nine and zero zero upon two point three not three multiplied by eight point three one four and multiplied by uh, five four six now we can do the calculation we can simplify it we can plug in the log values first two point four one eight and so multiplied by we have 10 to power minus 5 and it's a log value which we get that is minus minus 4.617 minus 4.617 this is the value we get minus 4.617 well plus the bottom value which we can have uh, multiply 2.303 and is multiplied by 8. Uh, 314 314 that is r value and multiplied by temperature 546 546 this is the value we get at the bottom and so we can divide the top value top value by the bottom one here we have 179900 and it is divided by the bottom one the value which we get that is 17.208 we can write it 17.21 here we have 17. 20 we can write 208 because three digits are there after decimal now we can do the subtraction here we can subtract uh here you can see that this is negative value this is positive two the value which we get 17.208 and minus 4.617 and the value which we get that is 12.591 here we have 12.591 and here we have log a and log a now we can transfer log on uh, right side or we can take anti log on both side as a result here we get a is equal to uh, 10 to power 12.591 and so or we can also write it as a anti log 12.591 then we can take uh, anti log 10 to powers the value which we get this is the value we get we can write this value in scientific notation we get 3.89 9 we can write it as 3.90 multiplied by 10 to power 12 this is quite large value 3.90 multiplied by 10 to power 12 and it is per second this is the pre exponential factor value you can see that how i calculated a value by using arrhenius equation when the rate constant k value is given energy of activation is given at particular temperature thank you if you like this video please click the like button. If you have any questions or suggestions, please comment below. For more updates on IIT JE or need exams, please subscribe to our channel to get lot of updates. Support us by following us on Facebook and Twitter. To sharpen your skills, please try out our test series on livetotalage.com. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.